I'm here today to talk to you about our sponsorship of the CBI's annual conference. In a moment, I'll be speaking to Karen Fairbrother and Simon Tyndall from the Business Development Unit. For years, our relationship with the CBI has been growing. It's very important to us. That's why last year we started sponsoring the CBI annual conference. Our relationship with the CBI helps us support employers and students by boosting skills and helping people find the right jobs and careers for them. Together, we can harness the digital revolution for the good of the workforce and the economy. Karen, how does the Open University help industry? There are many challenges for UK industry at the moment, um, and the pressing one is filling uh, the skills gap, particularly around high, um, higher education skills. It's even more pressing because UK industry has to compete more and more on a global basis. What's more, according to the CBI, um, the skills gap will be challenged to be filled if we just have traditional relationships with standard universities who are looking to provide that skills gap through traditional methods. What's more, if we now have over 70% of the 2020 workforce in industry already, there has to be a more flexible approach to how we can fill that um, expanding skills gap. And that's where the Open University can help. We are the pioneers in the distance learning solution. We're the pioneers in delivering a blended learning approach. And what's more, that approach means that the employee can add straight back into the workforce the very next day without extracting from the workplace. So we're in a fantastic position to help industry. Simon, what makes the Open University different from its competitors? Well, we've been doing distance learning for at least 45 years now, so we have a huge amount of experience. And particularly where we're focusing that experience a lot is on adults learning in the workplace. So today, of our 200,000 plus students, uh, at least 70% of those are studying with the OU whilst they're still doing full or part-time work. And we're not just resting back on our, on our laurels. Within those 45 years, we've continued to push the, the technology curve and the learning curve to produce world-class distance learning. An example of that would be our uh, launch of the FutureLearn MOOCs platform, which has really become the de facto standard for universities now doing MOOCs in the UK and beyond. And I think the other key piece is that we do scale. So we have numerous examples of working with both UK companies, with international companies, delivering on a national or international scale, such as Babcock International, First Group, uh, the Hay Group, etc. Karen, people will be interested in how the Open University can help their organisations. How should they go about getting in touch? Well, we'll be at the CBI conference. Um, we have our stand there, so it would be fantastic for um, corporates to come and visit us on the stand to share with us some of the challenges that they have, and we'd be delighted to talk those through. Um, it's really about understanding pain points. It's understanding those challenges to be able to offer the appropriate solution for them. Uh, more immediately, have a look on our website would be um, a great first step. Uh, look at the employer section. There's some examples of the fantastic work that we're doing to support U UK industry. We'd love to hear from them. Above all at the Open University, we want to support our students achieve their career goals. Working with industry can help with that and our relationship with the CBI is critical. Long may it continue. <laughs>